You do not want to miss this. Tonight we are seeing this intense moment as a woman's life was saved. It happened in Canton after she had some sort of medical emergency. Yeah, it's certainly scary to watch, but my goodness, our Isabel Lawrence has been following this story. Uh, and uh, Annette Nettie Conklin is alive today. Bless yes. her heart. What an incredible piece of video that we have to show folks. Tell us about this story and how this all unfolded. Absolutely, so incredible here. So I had the opportunity to chat with her. She says that those two officers, officers Matthew Mackamar and Austin Loot, they are her angels. Mm -hmm. So I went to her home. We chatted about what happened, the whole experience. She tells me that from what she remembers, one minute she was riding in the passenger seat of her husband's car. The next, she was waking up in the hospital. On October 5th, Nettie and her husband were driving near downtown Canton when she went into cardiopulmonary arrest. Now she's had seizures, but never anything like this. Her husband pulled over, called 911, began CPR, and that's when the officers arrived. And you can see here they continue CPR. Now these chest compressions went on for an agonizing minute and a half until she regained consciousness. Oh my gosh. I'm going to hug them and kiss them and thank them that they were there. And um, yeah, I, I couldn't thank them enough. And they're pretty young. So, um, you know, they might have, they might have to do this again, you know, in their career. So um, I want them to know that I'm, I'm very grateful. So Nettie actually hasn't been able to see those officers again, but she has actually goodie bags for them <laughs> with lifesaver oh, candies. Oh, there she out. is. <laughs> it's a gift to her own personal lifesavers, she says. And if you're wondering about her health now, she's still undergoing tests. And you may have noticed she has Bell's palsy now. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Her doctors believe that's temporary, but they're sure. still trying to work out, you know, what happened here. And uh, you want to stick with us ahead at 3 News at 6 because we spoke with some first responders who were on the scene to tell us, you know, kind of what the odds are about this happening and to her to make it out the other side. Mm -hmm. Has she seen the video? What is her response to the yeah, video? What was her reaction? She has seen the video. She told me her husband couldn't watch it. Oh, None of her family yeah. members could watch it. But she watched it because she wanted to know what happened because she didn't remember anything. <laughs> she wouldn't see her heart. Yeah, and she said it seems like they were going for a long time on oh, those compressions. Listen, a minute imagine. and a half is a, is long, a long time, time for something like that yeah. to continue. Oh, they didn't give up, though, and she's still amazing. here. They're her lifesavers. I love mm -hmm. the candy that she brought, the goodie bags. Yeah. They were lifesavers. Six o'clock. You want to make sure you mm -hmm. tune in for that. Thank, Thank you so much, Isabel. Thank you, Story. Love good news. Me too. Don't we all?